stock up on Twinkies because Hostess says it's going out of business. This announcement after striking workers across the country crippled the company's ability to make its snacks. Cakes Jordan Shefty is at the Hostess plant in Emporia with more. Jordan, okay. Mike, the plant might be closed, but union members remain on the picket line where they've been for the past week since last Friday, the day the strike started. But today, they had a different view. They watched as their supervisors carried boxes out of the plant across the street. Union members say they'll be here on the picket line until locks are placed on the doors of host, ho hostess. Hostess announced this morning that it is asking a federal bankruptcy court for permission to close its operations. The closing will impact nearly 18 and a half thousand workers, including a number here in Emporia. Union members we talked to this morning say it was only a matter of time before the plant closed its doors. Uh, it's, it's a relief. We knew it was coming. Uh, we're ready to move on. I mean, we understood what the, uh, the company leadership was trying to do. And I mean, I mean, we knew it was coming. It's great. It's a new beginning, a new day. We hope that it gets sold. We get a new buyer. That's that's what we've been hoping for the whole time. Hostess has said that the company plans to move all assets to the highest bidder, which local union members are hoping would mean good news for them. While employees and union members out here are disappointed that the closing happened so close to the holidays, they say that they are looking forward to be able to spend some time with their families rather than at the factory. We're live out in Emporia, Jordan Shefty, Cake News. And for continuing coverage of the company's closing, keep watching Cake News or check for updates anytime on our web channel, cake.com. Stock up on those Twinkies because Hostess says it's going out of business. This announcement after striking workers across the country crippled the company's ability to make its snacks. Cake's Jordan Shefty is at the Hostess plant in Emporia with more on this. Jordan, what can you tell us? Mike, union members have been lining up out here along the picket line for the past week. They've been holding signs like this one. Our dough makes your dough. You need us. Today, the company responded by shutting down operations. Hostess, the maker of Twinkies and Wonder Bread, announced this morning that it is asking a federal bankruptcy court for permission to close. The closing will impact nearly 18 and a half thousand workers, including a number here in Emporia. Union workers we talked to this morning say it was only a matter of time before the plant closed. Uh, it's, it's a relief. We knew it was coming. Uh, we're ready to move on. I mean, we understood what the, uh, the company leadership was trying to do. And I mean, I mean, we knew it was coming. It's great. It's a new beginning, a new day. We hope that it gets sold. We get a new buyer. That's, that's what we've been hoping for the whole time. Union members were upset with the company removing pension plans and changing benefits, so they went on strike last Friday. The company has said that it could not afford to continue operations through an extended strike. Hostess has said that they plan to move all assets to the highest bidder, which local union members are hoping would mean good news for them. While we've been out here this morning, we've watched as semi-trucks have returned to the plant. Smoke is no longer coming out of the factory, and we've watched as supervisors have carried boxes out to their cars. They're all signs of closing up shop. Reporting live in Emporia, Jordan Shefty, Cake News. All right, thank you, Jordan, for continuing coverage of the company's closing. Keep watching Cake News or check for updates anytime on our web channel. That, of course, is cake.com.